Hello there YouTube, this is I'm Jeripa here and this is my Barrow's Guide. Um, my live commentary didn't seem to work very well, but um, who cares, I'm dancing and this is basically my setup. So I got a Dragon Dagger Whip, um, I'll just show you in there. So I got, sorry about the quality, Fraps died on me so it did real bad quality, so I got all that gear. Got the OBK Private Dumb Warriors Quest or whatever it's called. That nubbed little quest. It's not nub, but he got what I mean. Um, the stars for the salamander. The room play. I haven't done barbarian assault and got the body yet. I've done the queen and stuff, but I just haven't had the time to finish it. Dragon legs, dragon boots. Haven't got enough tokens to charge it. I lost them while webs, and that is very important. I know everyone says it doesn't increase your drop rate, but I can almost guarantee you it does. So, um, yeah, so I've got noted food because I haven't done that quest that lets you access the bank and Berg de Rot. I don't know how to say it. But, um, so I sell them at the general store and then buy them back with coins. But I bought, in, I bring six prayer pots and the rest monks, aside from the super set and stuff, in my home tally. So, um, up here I was trying to show you the um where to go on the map but my fraps doesn't seem to like me going into maps to show people how to do it. So um I believe I oh, well it gives me even more time to explain your inventory to you but monkfish, prayer potions, super set, noted prayer potions and monks, coins, tokitzil, that was when I exited it. You can bring Dragon Defender instead. But, and also do not forget a spade. I forgot mine, but luckily I went in here before I went and got it. And yes, this is a little bit of a bank video. My bank is pathetic. As I have, um, a, an, a, an AGS lent out to a friend that time at all got sort. A lot of crushed gems. I don't know why. So I must be having a gem party, but. Okay. So now you're going to, um, teleport to my house. I enter in building mode. I do not know why my house is here, but it is, so just deal with it. If you don't like it, close the video. No, I'm just joking, keep watching it. So go to a building mode, then you don't have to open the doors. Just all my prayer. I like my, there's my stats. Got show of them. I'm happy with my 77 room crafting and 87 magic. My next 99 party will, I actually don't know what it'll be. Highly likely cooking. Oh, sorry about that, it's burped, but um, what else can I say? There's my boxing ring into the curl portal. If you don't have one, just teleport to Canifus. Or just get there, however you do. But a lot of people take the underground tunnel thingy. I don't like it. Because I tend to um, find it slower and I get my food stolen more. But just a, a warning, I do kind of get lost. And yeah, I do not know how, but I somehow got lost. But, however, before you actually enter the, like, start running rest, up to four, as it reduces their chances of stealing a boo, or ghasts, or whatever they're called. People say to bring that little pouch from nature's spirit, not worth it. I mean, there goes one inventory spot you could have a food in that would, could, but it's probably not going to get stolen anyway. So you get a hundred run, then you basically just keep on running, um, or south, west, east. So, where you're looking at me now, left. But gets my food. But you keep running there, kind of as much as you can. But I go down too far. I normally would turn left there rather than keep on going down. I turn left there. So you turn left at that big swab of them. Then you kind of pass through this big as barrage of them here. So I went too far. I do get there pretty fast again. I realize where I am, and I, for some reason, open up the map, which I. Then I noticed my fraps counter disappeared. So it kind of didn't work very well, but oh well, you still kind of get it. So I did get lost here, rather than turning in like I should have, I do here. Just get sick of it. And right now, when I'm reading the commentary, I'm going, oh, that's right, I'm supposed to go over here. I completely remembered. There I open the map, and then I remember fraps doesn't work in the map. I do not know why. So I just closed it, and... Keep going. 
And so I just kind of ignore this part. I'm real sorry, but I didn't have the time to remake it. And the Swamp Bodhi is north of me. Where I end up going, there it is. And I don't see it for a while either. I'd see it like right at the end. Um, I don't know exactly what much there is to talk about, but there's a cool little. I reckon it's quite juicy because JGX are budget and they won't buddy make any animations and stuff. And this is like some real slow as one. I find it quite funny, but I do a very. Oh, I got Swamp Decade, and that was amazing. I've never had that happen to me before because I've never been in there long enough. But that budget eyes uh, little animation, I'm not allowed to swear because I don't like it. But um, I will cut it out when I'm in the tunnels for quite a bit of it because I fail in them so bad. I will show you what happens when you get a puzzle wrong. Uh, Kid dropped that food and it stinks apparently, so. I don't want that, and then there's some little Max guy over here, who I say, who says hi, there he is, oh, is he Max? No, not quite. Say hi to your tool. So then you just run, I do them in this order, I go to Harrick's, I check how much prayer I have left, if I have much, I'll go to Guffin's, then I hopefully don't have enough, and then I'll go to Varak, who you don't pray against, then I will go to Arim. I will speak him, and then I go to the ranger person, Corel, and then you go to Torag. However, do not enter your mystery. Oh, make sure you do pray the protect prayers against all of them except for Varak. This guy, Derek, Derek can hit your max H, can hit like something over 800 when he's under like a tenth of HP. He can hit straight on you, but he cannot hit you through prayer. I'm just showing you my super sets here because I forgot to tell you about them earlier in the live commentary, but it doesn't matter, I'm telling you now. Make sure you do not turn your prey off under any circumstances unless <coughs> until you see his, anim his dying animation. If you do, I have been one hit by them before, but luckily I got back here fast enough. I just took food and energy potions and gapped it back here. So when he's doing that animation, you can run out. And I go to Guffins here as I have enough prayer. I think I do need to drink a dose on him, but that doesn't really matter. So dig the spade on top of the hoof, enter pray melee. Um, I fail like crazy on Torag. I do not know why. Or Torag, whatever. Just don't yell at me. But Torag, or however you say it, he, I couldn't hit him. I got really frustrated. It took me like 30 seconds or something to kill him. So I'm highly likely going to cut out that fight. Um, and probably just put come back at the end of the fight. I will cut out the tunnels. Um, sorry, I was just checking there if my sound recording was actually working. But I will cut out the tunnels as they didn't work. Or I will I highly like to actually just put them on like triple speed because I this dragged on for so long it wasn't funny. So you run out of the animation, don't have much pre left. I think I stick on rapid heal. But I'll stick on your quick prayers for whatever attack style your tunnel person uses. So I luckily get a room the easiest one. Who almost always does a um weakening spell at the start. This guy almost KOs me. But he, no point in praying, he will hit straight through it anyway. But he hits very decent and quite often. I do not know why, but I couldn't hit today. This was probably the worst trip I've done. I got sharks from the um, chest, the rear chest thingy. I've never got a rear for some reason. Oh, well, I've had, but like not often. Like, I haven't ever got a double, like two barrows items in one, but. He could have probably won at me there. It's not exactly been good for a commentary video, but oh well. So the animation, run out. Oh, you can see my fraps counter. I put that on so many times, I'd be almost finished a guide. And then I'd see that, the, and then I'd, well, I would have finished it and I'd go on. This is about the fourth time recording this. And it wouldn't, fraps wouldn't have recorded it. So I just do that to make sure it is there. So never it appears, just ignore it. So speak up, drink your pots. This was a rim, I think. So, entered there. Oh, he's my tunnel. So I got lucky with that. Deactivate the prayers. 
Not the ranger. So drink a super sip. I didn't drink mine. I don't know why. I would have drank it probably while I was in the fight when I realized. And that was my phone. Just ignore that. Don't worry about it. But um, speak him. I maul him. I don't do good when I kill him pretty fast. So basically, I don't exactly think there's much more to go until I get to the tunnel. So I will show you all the fights except the toe rag. I could not hit him. Like, no jokes. I couldn't even touch him. Nick him, whatever you call it. Then you want to pot up and do him. I do him last because he tends to not hit very much, but I get really frustrated. With my salamander, and I will do the start of the fight. Like, the first 10 seconds, so he restores run energy or something on you, so. Alright, so I'm going to skip this fight as this takes me about five to ten minutes to do at least so I will be right back okay I am back and I just killed him with almost eating all my food having to eat almost all my food sorry so then I go then you go to a tunnel um that fight was too embarrassing to show I reckon it took me at least three or five minutes to kill him it was pathetic so you equip prayers to whatever your um cave person has I love Sony Vegas. I don't know where that came from, but I just love it. Into your tunnel. Don't worry, it's relatively safe. And for some reason, I had monsters in here on my way out. And I will show you what happens when you get a. And this was very lucky of me, but I kind of had to get rid of it to show you. Um. Um. What happens when you get one wrong? So it's kind of bad. I'm just texting someone on my phone went off again. So there's my door right next to my thing. But the only door that can get you to the chest is the one that's open. As I, I think that's kind of obvious. But mm. Alright, so I get a 10 kill count. It doesn't increase the chances of your barrows drops. But you can get bolt racks. It, it, the loots you get no matter what kill count pay for your food and stuff. So you don't lose money. Or I haven't. Yeah, and then when you get a bloody, I don't know, Karul's top or... Charles body, you're rich. I mean legs, whatever they're called. But um So what you want to do to open it is um I've got crypt spiders for this one, but I do get it all on purpose to show you what happens. Is you wanna get them to one side of the room, then sprint down there. Then I answer it wrong there to show you, and it moves around. So then you just search in there for your erect or not correct erect in it. That's what she said. Sorry about that, but I just had to say that. I think I get a rim right now. Yep, there he is. So you attack him, drink a pot, click on your prayer, and I speak him. The he's relatively fast kill for me, but I think I am about to just skip forward in the video a little bit. Oh no, I'm not. I'm just checking up my timeline now. No, I'm not. But just kill him. If you've got the Herrick, it is so important to pray in here. But then when you've got spray of prayer points, I use rapid heal. You don't gain it. Ah, oh, so I mean it's really stiffing. Let me quit it. Okay, I'm back. But um, it's just worth it because you could, and if you bring a um heal restore brace or whatever it's called, that onyx bracelet enchanted rest, and then that you heal so fast it's not funny. Oh, I haven't talked about familiars. If you have like a healing familiar, like a bunyip or unicorn stallion, bring it. And you could also replace, I think I might have said this, but you could replace the DDS for a Ceridum and God Sword. I'm too poor to get one at the moment. It's my AGS is being lent. So answer the puzzle right. You can look up the answers. Let's Google it, RuneScape, Barrows, answers. Then get your 10 kill count. Make sure you go through both doors. But um, I think I have about to skip the video forward a little bit here so just pop left and right through those doors and you generally get the lower level things then when you get your 10 kill count um, run over to the chest I don't get anything here open it search it and I got junk and then basically you want to I'm not going to skip this part but if you you can I, I didn't bank at the um, uh, general stores. I didn't have enough time to show you what to do, but you basically just run to the general store, sell it, 
um, sell them like however many months that you want to buy back. Oh, and I forgot about that, but I lagged out really badly there. It was horrendous. But I sell it to them and then buy it back. I didn't end up doing it myself and I don't price check my things as I was in a rush. I just ended at the top. But um I get really unlucky and um find my rope is on the one door I can't open and I have to run around the whole thing. That happens to me almost every time. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, oh, oh, and they've added a new update that shows you. Oh, I found two new cool updates. But when I do death rune run, death runes for money, I make about 480, 500k an hour doing that. I use home teleport on ancients as, rather than that stupid half an hour time limit they used to have, it, you can do it whenever you want, as often as you want. Now you don't have to wait at all. So I use that rather than edge will teleport. I don't know what that is to do with it, but they had two hidden updates. Well, that, the other one I'm talking about isn't hidden, but that was the Ring of Wealth. It'll tell you when you've um got when it's improved your drop. As you can see, mine has says your ring shines more brightly or something. I can't read it, but I have enemies in there. I never knew that before. So just climb up, get out of there as fast as you can, and. I will in the commentary here, but please sure to like the video, um, comment on it, and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, um, and yes, I am a girl, not in real life. Goodbye.